My name is Daniel Garcia. My life used to be pretty normal. I worked at my family's bakery in Little Havana with my mom, my dad, my crazy brother, my little sister. I had a girlfriend. Life was good. Until she decided to propose. Will you marry me? And I decided to say no. That's when everything changed. I met Noah Hamilton as an international superstar, fashion icon, one of the most famous women in the world. That Noah Hamilton. The next few days were crazy, fun, <laughs> sexy, romantic. She rocked my world. You're fearless. And my family's too. What happened? Your girlfriend happened. She's changed our lives. No, Hamilton is playing my song at her party. <gasps> but then her manager says she picked up people like me all the time. Normal guys. She does this after every heartbreak. Noah Hamilton, the model, and Colin Davis, the actor, have broken up. I just flew halfway across the planet to tell you that I love you. You can imagine how surprised I was by her invitation. I'm going to Puerto Rico next week. I'd like you to come. I don't get it. I don't get it. How can you just act like all you're doing is packing? Because that is all I'm doing. Oh. Daniel, I don't think you understand the universe-bending nature of what is happening. You're in denial, Daniel! Taking Baker Boy on this trip is a big mistake. Oh, and it sends the wrong message. Like what? Like that you and her are gonna do the deed? The idea that my brother and the most famous woman in the world might possibly hop into bed together? He's gonna be clingy and awkward, not to mention a public relations nightmare. Help me out here, Pipes. I think it'll be fun. Lewis, relax. It's one day and one night. It's an overnight, an out-of-town getaway. It's a charity benefit for a school she's helping build. You think he cares about that, Miss Skinny Dip? It was not like that. I mean, it's a great night, but... Being with her just feels natural. He's sweet. She's smart. He's kind. She's funny. Yeah. OK. I'm going to throw up. I'm going to throw up. Hi, my amor. Mom, I'm going to Puerto Rico, not the moon. I don't care. Mira, this is your grandfather's rosary. I want you to say three Hail Marys before the plane takes off. Mom, okay? what? do you hear yourself? Let me ask you something, Miss Sabelo Todo. If I'm wrong, it costs him nothing. But if I'm right, hmm, 20 centuries of guilt summed up in 11 words. I'll post something every few hours so you guys can keep up on my adventures, OK? <gasps> I a visit to Piñones. Ooh, or your night at the gala. Oh, what happens after that <laughs> when he is back in the honeymoon suite? I... It smells something burning, so. I'm ready. Promise me one thing. She's a celebrity. She makes people fall in love with her for a living. Just don't get carried away. Dad, I won't. Let's go. Ma'am? Champagne, sir? Sir. confirm the food, the linens, the decorations. They've all arrived safely. I'm going to park myself in that ballroom and make sure that everything goes perfectly. You know how I get about events. Love you madly. Love you more. Piper? Yo. <laughs> hey, come sit down. Just don't make me laugh. Can't make any promises. I have to focus. I'm learning tonight's speech, and I'm dyslexic, so it takes me a little longer. That's why you do this stuff with schools. After the storm, I was seeing images of children playing in the street because they didn't have schools to go to. So I decided to do something about it. That's really cool. Okay, I've got updates for you and ground rules for you. Junket is set. 14 outlets, five minutes each, all of them promising to focus on your charity work. Oh, we've got some last minute updates on the guest list. Kendall and Kylie flaked. Shocker. Chrissy and John are now maybes. Oh. Melanie Kahn is on the island. No way. Yes. Lewis. This is your chance to finally meet her and show her how fabulous you are. As for you, I need your signature. It's an NDA, non-disclosure agreement, basically saying that you won't talk about your time with Noah. He doesn't have to sign that. No, no. If it makes Gucci happy, then OK. Yeah, it makes Gucci happy. All right, 
Next, in case you both lose your minds, no touching, no kissing, no whispering sweet nothings, no anything that the press can interpret as romance, okay? Okay, NDA's good, PDA's bad. I got it. You know, I know it's all the rage for most celebrities to live every twist and turn of their personal lives on social media, but Noah is not most celebrities, okay? Her brand connotes more than good taste. It connotes class. Think Kennedy, not Kardashian. Do you know who the Kennedys were? Okay, I think he gets it, Lewis. <laughs> Does he? Because, honey, we were able to dodge full-blown tabloid coverage of your breakup with Colin only because the two of you didn't feed the fire. Gucci, it makes sense. I won't make any more jokes. Thank you. One more thing. Your room key, 103. Your bag's already in there. 103? This is the fourth floor. They didn't have anything closer? They didn't have anything further away. I think he's starting to like me. <laughs> I'll see you later. later. Yeah, it's been one of my better rental properties, but it's time to sell. The question, Ms. Sanchez, is are you the agent to sell it for me? Problem? Oh, <laughs> minor inconvenience, Mr. Weiss. Fantasy can be dangerous. Too many real estate agents don't know this. They'd walk their clients through this house and ask them to imagine what it could be. Me? I'd sell it based on what it already is. I'm not interested in appealing to dreamers who never buy anything. I'm interested in the people who are ready to take the plunge. So if you list with me, I'll have my stagers here by noon in my first open house tomorrow because this place is already special. Ms. Sanchez, as someone who knows business, take it from me. You have a bright future. Thank you. I'll get the paperwork. Uh, you have kids? My oldest, Zach. His bar mitzvah has been nothing but trouble. The venue, the rabbi. Now I lost the DJ. The, the DJ? I might have someone. Is it Daniel? No. It's a uh, wrong number. A very, very wrong number. He's there. Oh, he is. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, look at that placita. Rafael, mira. Look. Mm. Is everything okay? Fine. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. I heard Mr. Perez might be retiring, and that means that the building next door might become available. And if our business stays this successful, who knows? Mari, por favor, guarde pan para mayo y lleva los caballos. Amy? Who's Amy? Oh, just my friend from school. Uh, 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 you have a friend? Judging by your tone, sounds like you'd think cold fusion was more likely. Cold? Who's cold? I'm just excited that you have a friend. I know how hard it's been, and now Mom, I'm gonna... please, the more you talk, the worse it gets. Ma? Mm hmm What did you just do? Invited her over. Oh, my God. You invited as me from my phone. You're welcome. Why did you use three emojis? Okay, don't make eye contact. Don't slow down. We have no time for autographs, and we don't want to hurt anyone's feelings, all right? Is it always like this? Always. Oh, no. Your ex. Louis, you didn't tell me that Colin was coming to the gala. Oh, I should have known. The guy does not shy away from a good publicity stunt. It doesn't matter. It'll be good for the fundraiser. You okay? I'm fine. Because I could go do something. <sighs> like what? Like, tell him how bad his last two movies were. <laughs> they were. Thank you so much. 
so now she just answers questions? <laughs> Sounds easy, does it? So, Noah, you came here two years ago and promised to help rebuild our damaged schools. And your mission is accomplished. How does it feel? I'm humbled by what the Puerto Rican people have been able to achieve. Tell us, how does it feel? I'm thankful to have been a part of something so important. How do you feel? It's very rewarding to see children get the resources they deserve. Over and over, you get the same question. Over and over, you have to make it sound like it's new. So what is it about Puerto Rico? You feel connected to the island? Why Puerto Rico? I have a really strong connection to this island. I love the people. I love the culture. So, Noah, let's talk about the big breakup with Colin Davis. Oh, no. Well, no, 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 no. Marcia, are you kidding me? We had a deal, remember? Now, you get that glorified weather girl back on topic now, or the next interview she does is going to be for a job at the supermarket. Yeah? Thanks. Right. So, back to tonight's big event. I don't want to blend in. I just want to stand out. I'm a comfort I win. I ain't gonna back down. Yeah, I put in the work, work. Now it's time to go play, play. I'm gonna take my turn, turn. Watch me do my thing, thing. She makes it look easy, doesn't she? Never mind that everybody's judging her, presenting her, adoring her, rooting for her to succeed or fail. He's crazy. All right, have a good day and uh, check this guy out. Here's the best in town, so check him out. <laughs> have a good one. All right, it's a great day at Raphael's. How can I help you? By returning my phone calls. Vanessa, I can't seem to come up with a good lie. I have a client who needs a DJ. If you want the job, you'll have to come meet him on your lunch break, okay? Yeah, thank you. <gasps> Mira, I think that's her. That's Amy, Natalie's friend. Mari, Mari, Ma Mari, please, Mari. Hi. <laughs> You must be Amy. I'm Mari, Natalie's mom. Oh. <laughs> she says such nice things about you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> Honey, why don't you take the afternoon off? This place is emptying out anyway. Uh, Just go. Go, go. You girls go have fun. Okay. Go, go, go. Bye. 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 That was crazy. I have a whole new respect for being famous. Uh, 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 what part of PD or A do you not understand? Sorry. Thank you. How long do you have until you have to start getting ready for tonight? Oh, Actually, we should hours. have her now. I thought we could have some fun. And I know of a really good place to take you. Okay. Just make sure she eats something, please. Where are you going to take me? You're going to love it. This is Piñones. I've always wanted to come here. This part of the island is Afro-Caribbean, so the heritage is similar to Cuba. Oh, yeah? Did you get that from TripAdvisor? TripAdvisor? What? That's my middle name. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, these little stands behind us, they're called kioscos. You're about to taste the entire island's cuisine, but with one caveat. What? Almost everything is fried. Ooh. What about this one? This is the famous one, right? This is it. Alca... Okay, yeah. You want to buy? Ciao. <laughs> Me. How perfect is this? It's great, right? Mm, it's incredible. Hermano, ¿cómo te llamas? Ruben Vélez, para servirle. Ruben Vélez. I'm Daniel, and this is... Noah. I'm glad you two like our alcapurrias. Oh, my God, they're amazing. What's inside them? It's my grandmother's secret recipe. Only she, my father, and I know it. Yeah, my grandma was the same way about her lechon. You're Cuban. De un paro las dos alas. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bienvenido. It's an old expression meaning that Puerto Rico and Cuba are two wings of the same bird. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. yeah. You know what? Give me your phone. I want to film that for your family. They're going to love it. Come on. All right. Está bien. Sí, sí, sí. We're ready. <laughs> hey, guys. I finally made it to Piñones, and I'm here with my new friend, Ruben Velez. Yes. Who makes the most incredible acapurrias. The inside is so perfect. Thank you. Ruben, you have to tell us how you make something simple taste so good. The pork recipe is a family secret, but the real answer is love. 
You need to do it with a lot of love, Daniel. Come on, I know there's more. Dale, dale, come on. Cut me some slack. If I tell you, my father will never speak to me again. My dad's the same way, too. <laughs> but we don't post that part. <laughs> too late. Too late. Uh, you post that, I can never go back to Miami. Okay. Ruben, hablamos. Provecho. Caminito de mi campo. Bordo mi recuerdo van. Las flores en flamboyán. Son alfombras bajo el lampo. Lumino soy allí estampo. Mi arco iris de emociones. Flamboya que me florece. Se ve la longuina espera. Florece con tus hermanos. You know you're a real natural in front of the camera? No, I'm serious. Because most people can't be themselves when a camera's on them. But you really made it feel like we were having a conversation. The way I see it, food is the one thing we all have in common. Doesn't matter who you are, where you are, food has a way of connecting people. What? Salud. Salud. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of being natural, you want to act? How'd you know? I saw your face when Lewis mentioned Melanie Kahn. Oh. I like her movies. It's not something I really tell people, because I'm sensitive. You know, it's a cliche. I get it. When I was little, I didn't really have a family. I had a mom sometimes, and dad never. So I used to create my own worlds, and my own characters, and write little plays. Lewis thinks I'm crazy. He says I have too much to lose and that there's no upside. But... Hey. Fear is a terrible reason not to try. Exactly. My little brother, Mateo, he's into music now. But when we were younger, he wanted to be a director. He'd always try to borrow people's cameras, shooting everything. He even tried to get me to act in them. These I need to see. These you will never see. I just told you how captivating you are on camera. Captivating? Is that in the same neighborhood of sexy? They may share a street. <laughs> Let me guess. Louis, I'm having fun. What? Okay, I'm coming back now. Melanie Khan wants to meet me. Dude, my dad is the same way. <laughs> what? Don't post that part. Your brother seems cool. He's got like an Anthony Bourdain thing going on. Daniel? Yeah, he's pretty great. Molly, have you seen my clean underwear? Never mind, I'm good. My other brother? Not so much. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's she like? Noah, I actually got to talk to her on the phone for a little. She's really nice. I used to have the biggest crush on her. Who am I kidding? I still do. <laughs> a crush? Like, on her. What do you guys think? I think you should knock. Door's open. So, the outfit, I'm going to meet about a gig, and I want to look super successful, but, you know, I want to play it down a little bit so I don't look a little too materialistic. You nailed it. Yeah. Thank you. So do you need anything else or? No. Okay. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> you girls need anything? Five uninterrupted seconds of peace and quiet, maybe? I don't know. Oh, yeah, don't get snappy. She gets snappy when she's hungry. <laughs> I'll make you guys some snacks. Amy, you want to stay for dinner? Love to. Okay. <laughs> Yay. I love dinner. <laughs> MC Cubano, huh? It's catchy. Yeah, you know, I wanted something to embrace my heritage. Well, uh, Vanessa speaks very highly of you. You're free the 14th? 14th, uh, yeah, let me check. You know what, for you, yes. Great. 
great. The music needs to be profanity free, obviously, and uh, include some classics so the older guests can enjoy it along with the uh, children. Children? I'm sorry, what kind of gig is this? It's a bar mitzvah. A bar mitzvah? Yeah. Are any of these limitations a problem for you? No, no, not unless you're some kind of hack who just wants to spin Justin Bieber songs. Listen, I'm an artist, you know? You hire me to do what I do, not to censor me, not to limit me, to let me rock your world, you know? That's why you hire me. Actually, uh, MC Cubano, I think that's why I don't hire you. MC Cubano. Vanessa, what are you thinking? What? This guy's not going to work. Yeah, that was insulting. Oh, yeah, it was. Oh, you're mad at me? He wanted me to play a bar mitzvah. Oh, I'm sorry. Is high school dance where you draw the line? I'll have to remember that the next time I ask the head of CTO Records to hire you. Weiss? Eli Weiss? Yes. I can fix this. Let me just smooth things over. A steamroller wouldn't smooth over the mess he made. Do you want this job? Yes. You sure? Yes. Follow me and do exactly as I say. Melanie, I'm such a huge fan. Thank you so much, Noah. And thank you for meeting me on such short notice. No problem. My pleasure. Can I have a water, please? Look, I think it's great what you're doing in Puerto Rico and around the world. I'm sorry I can't be at your event tonight, but I have this for your foundation. This is very generous of you. I just hope it doesn't feel like a bribe. How so? I have a film starting production next week, and I have an actress who just checked herself into rehab. It's a small role, but I've been banging my head trying to come up with the right fit for the part, and I thought of you. Wow. Well, I would be very happy to read for that role. You don't have to audition. The part is yours if you want it. It's, it's three weeks' work, and we would need you there in Toronto tomorrow, ideally. Wait a second, Toronto. Um, is this the film you're doing with Colin Davis? Yes, he said you'd be perfect for it and that the personal history wouldn't be an issue. So is she great or is she great? I told you you would love piñones. <laughs> so what else, mi amor, what else, what else? I, I, what is it like to travel with a celebrity? I mean, it's different than I imagined. I thought it'd be all parties and stuff, but she spent hours talking to the press about helping the island and just how much she could help with me. No, she's just a great person. Well, depending on how tonight goes, maybe we'll invite her over for dinner. <laughs> I'm keeping her away from our dinners for as long as possible. What is that supposed to mean? Okay, I gotta go, Ma. Bye. <laughs> now we're not good enough for our son. I <laughs> I know it's a leap and maybe a scary one. I wouldn't be here if I didn't think you and I would make a great team. I'm so much to hear you say that. Just let me know tomorrow, either way. Absolutely. Hey, Colin. Thanks, Melanie. How dare you use acting to worm your way back into my life? Wow, slow down, though. So this has nothing to do with us? Yeah, sure it does. I mean, in the fact that I thought we were still friends, at least. <laughs> oh. And if I say yes, then I have to be in Toronto by tomorrow. Honey, how are you feeling about it? Confused. For what it's worth, it's about working with Melanie Kahn, not Colin. It's about chasing your dream. I think you should do it. I hate to admit it, but I think he's right. Colin is a side note. Uh, this is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Piper, what happened? Did you fall in the pool? A uh, water main underneath the hotel burst and... It's a geyser in there. Well, are they fixing it? Oh, no. You don't understand. It's all ruined. The food, the decorations. Oh. We have hundreds of people who paid to come to a gala. There is no gala. I'm so, I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry, Noah. You know what? I will wait outside and I'll explain to everybody. No, no, no. We're not giving up. Well, well, what about another hotel? Well, it's not about the space, Lewis. It's about all the stuff that we put in. It's the food, the decorations. It's, it's all destroyed. But, but still, uh, Noah is right. We do not give up. We have two hours to recreate a meticulously planned gala that celebrates children and education. And we're in a predominantly Catholic country. So we are due for a miracle. I got it. What? Uh, Baker boy, uh, no offense, but when I said miracle, I didn't mean pastelitos. How about a whole island of cuisine? Everybody wants the fantasy. 
the dream, the sports car, even if they can only afford the rusty pickup. So you sell them the rusty pickup and make them believe they're getting the sports car. Yep. Wait, am I the rusty pickup in this scenario? You are the guy that's going to keep his mouth shut. Vanessa, you really think this is going to work? After your debacle with Mr. Weiss, we have no choice. We go over his head. Huh? This guy is the next Drake. He's Degrassi era now, but he's about to blow up. So do you want to break the next Drake, or do you want the same DJ your cousin had? His greatest achievement was getting your booby to church to the village people. I don't know. Bobby likes the YMCA, and sure it's a mean birthday check. Yo, any fool can play that stuff. All right, I have cutting edge lyrics. He's right. He does. And you know who else likes him? Noah Hamilton. That's dope. That's you? I'm telling you, he doesn't look like much, but he's the real deal. Did I mention that hiring MC Cubano would piss your parents off? Let's do this. So, you think I'm crazy? No? This will work? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. This is it, huh, Daniel? Yeah, yeah. It's good. I yeah. like it. Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. What are you doing here? Was I gonna wait in my room like some kind of princess? <laughs> All right, let's go, guys. Let's Come on. Luck. You showed up. Well played, Hamilton. Come on, let's do it. Are you afraid of breaking a nail? some for the guests. I'm testing for quality control. Is that it? That's it. 20 minutes to spare. Oh. We gotta get changed before anyone sees us like this. Let's go, Hamilton. Thank you. So before, when you said that your brother knew Noah Hamilton, I thought it was one of those lies that you tell people when you're new somewhere and you want to say something that makes you seem cool. Yeah, I tried those, but they always backfired. I'm a terrible liar. <laughs> I would say something and then like two seconds later, take it back. <laughs> I once told a boy that I had herpes when he tried to kiss me. <laughs> That's a good one. Until he told the whole school. Ouch. <laughs> So, um, do you like boys or girls or both? Um, none of the above? No, I, I mean, I like you. Be careful, what are you doing? Nothing, um, nothing. Actually, Amy was just leaving. Aw, she is? Yeah, uh, we were we were talking and now we're done, so she's gonna go home. Oh, but Amy, I made some merenguito besitos. They're tiny kisses of meringue made with a lot of love. Thanks, Mrs. Garcia, but Natalie's right. I have to go. Night. Good night. I thought it was going so well. Oh.
Howard. So, what do you think? It's incredible. Thank you so much. I mean, when I say this, what you did today was absolutely amazing. I'm a closer. I close. You knew. Yeah. About Daniel going to Noah's birthday party? Mateo, I know about everything. And yet you still stand up for me like that. We're family. I know it might not feel like it to you, maybe not any of you. But the four years Daniel and I were together, you were all a part of that. And if Daniel comes to his senses, maybe we'll all end up closer. Okay. Two things before I go. First, no more Vanessa Princesa. You, uh, knew about that? I told you I know about everything. And the, uh, second thing? I get 10% of every gig you book from now on. And don't you even try to negotiate with me. I'll see you. <laughs> Buenas noches. Gracias. First of all, I want to thank you all for being here tonight. I'm happy to report that thanks to your generous contributions, we will soon be constructing 12 additional schools. As some of you may know, our original venue was flooded tonight and all of our plans were washed away. But like the people of this island, my friends didn't despair. They rebuilt, they improvised, and they made something magical, no? Something unforgettable. To me, that says, when you do things with love and with passion, you can overcome even the most challenging of obstacles. Thank you so much, Puerto Rico, for your support. And now let's dance! Yo sé que no es tu paso millonaria. Soy progresión sana, brillas, pulsaras. Un día para Mumbai, ya sea buena Marta. Siempre ven escultada, probada, bala. El cabuldría es tan invelida, culo blanco. Ruben, I couldn't have done this without you. How amazing this turned out. She's really something, isn't she? Colin Davis. Daniel Garcia. I saw how you pulled all this together, man. It's really impressive what you did. So you and Noah are friends? She's got a way, right? Makes you kind of feel like you're the only guy in the world. Even if you're not. Hey. Hey, I see Daniel. You know, and hopefully you will not see Daniel. Seriously. Did no. she tell you she wants to be an actress? That's a lifelong dream of hers. <laughs> Actually just got her a role in my next film. We leave tomorrow. Uh, she's not gonna have much time for anything else. I just wanted to let you know, bro to bro. I learned today how celebrities like you have to smile when you're in public. Even if you're making an ass out of yourself. Stop me when I'm wrong. Noah broke it off. Then you begged her to get back together. She said no. Then she asked you not to come to this event and yet you still came. Now you're using her dream to try to get her back in your life. Is that the story? Don't lose that smile, superstar. 
Hold on to it. Because your dignity, that's not gone. Hey. Wow. You look beautiful. Thank you, Colin. For what? For making this decision so easy for me. You didn't get me that role for me. That was for you. Which is why I'm going to tell Melanie Khan that I'm not taking it. But please, stay and enjoy the food. It's delicious. Gig. Hmm. Who died? Something happened between Natalie and her friend Amy, and now she's not talking. Not one word. Do you know how hard it is for your sister not to say one word? Congratulations on the job, Mijo. We'll have to celebrate when the family's all back together. Vanessa helped, actually. She's uh, a good person. Do you hear me? Do you even hear the words that are coming out of my mouth right now? What happened with Amy? Nothing. Why do you ask? Well, because I'm your brother and I love you a lot more than I love Daniel and I have eyes. Look, I know I act a fool like 99% of the time, but that's just how I deal with life. But I actually pay attention. And as someone who has seen his fair share of women storming off, I'm sort of an expert. So. I told her to leave. I really like her. And I think she likes me, and she's so nice, and I freaked out. Can you believe that? Yeah, I can. Call her. But I can't. Yes, you can. You better call her. My mom's going to call her, you know that. Well, what do I even say? Hell if I know. They always hang up on me. No one can see us leave together. So you walk on that side, and I'll walk on this side, okay? Honey, what's wrong with you? You've been distracted all day. I'm worried about Danny. Nice to meet you. How you been? I had you smooth like a rocket. Welcome in. Nice to meet you. How you been? I had you like lightning. Come on in. Nice to meet you. I mean, she's beautiful, but people like Noah Hamilton, they're not like us. They don't live in the real world. So nice to meet you. I don't want Daniel getting used to that. I don't want him living in some some fantasy. Because if he does get swept up in it, what happens when he falls back to earth? So nice to meet you. No PDA, remember? Well, good thing we're not in public anymore. Miss Hamilton, can I have an autograph? Ooh. Yeah, sure. Uh, can you make it out to Rami Chase? That's me. <laughs> what 
What floor? Uh, three. <laughs> Rummy, right? Yes. My mom said not to bother you, but she was wrong. <laughs> what are you writing? To Rummy, who will never know how much she made me smile when she surprised me in the elevator. Oh my god, <laughs> that's perfect. <laughs> oh, can I take a photo? Sure, absolutely. Yeah. Um, will ya? Mm -hmm. yeah. One, two, three. It's nice. Oh, this is me. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. We should wait till our floor. Forget that. Crazy. I like that. You like that. So let's be crazy. The contact, impact. I want that daily. Our breath getting deeper, deeper. 